Hey, what's up everyone? Welcome back to the channel. So today I'm back with more of uh, The Warning. Uh, this is their live performance of Black Holes at Dakota Bar in 2018. Um, I've uh, seen in the comments that this is some of y'all's favorite uh, song by them. Uh, and I've been told that I believe uh, Pal was on the uh, piano, but you've got, some of you have told me that they're all classically trained on the piano, uh, which is awesome. Um, I'd be interested to see performances where the other, where Danny and Ale are on the piano also. But uh, yeah, um, some of y'all said this is your favorite song by them, so I'll be uh, interested to see uh, what, uh, what this is like. So I'm gonna hop into it and see what they got for me. I'm a sucker for piano, so. It's like she needs all. broken bottles didn't know I had these many scars I thought I had won all of my different battles but I'm corrupt I got nothing mm. left it's got pretty boys I so my love trying to forget ignore your calls and throw the phone away please believe me when I say okay I can tell they're all about to get into it so I just want to pause real quick um She's got a beautiful voice, and all three of them do. Um, this is one of the few songs I've seen where her vocals are isolated, um, and she's the only one singing, actually. This is like a solo performance for the opening, which is really cool. Um, so yeah, I'm, I'm liking this so far. I'm interested to see where they go with it, but she's got a beautiful voice, and it's really cool to uh, hear her voice kind of isolated from the, the rest of the band. So uh, let's get back into it. I'm going to go back just a little bit, actually, here. Okay. Away, please believe me when I say Don't hold on, don't hold on, don't hold on to me. Don't hold on, don't hold on. I got nothing left to give. But I keep on coming, begging for more. Retro boys. So I'm kind of curious, did she write this song? Because she's really passionate when she's singing this. Like, she's got a little grit to her voice, which is really cool. But she's really getting into this. Like, she's really, I can tell she's really, like, passionate. and sounds really emotional, actually, with it. Um, I'm curious if this is, like, a personal uh, story from her own life or if she just wrote this song and what the backstory is uh, for the song. Anything y'all know, please put in the comments. I appreciate it. But, yeah, I'm just kind of curious with how passionately she's singing this, if this is from personal experience um, or anything like that. So I'm going to get back into it. It's interesting. I know she's about to get into the vocals again, but um, I feel like this is one of the few ballads of theirs that I've heard. They got beautiful ballads. Um, loving the
part, but this is more of a ballad, so uh, you might have a solo. We've got about two minutes left. Um, so it'll be interesting to see if it's a solo. It'll be interesting to see also if uh, Powell has a piano solo coming up. But um uh, definitely has a more somber tone to it, the ballad. Um, I don't know if this is about a relationship or just about her personal life or, um, like I said, I don't know if there's a story behind this, but I'd be interested to learn more about this. So, um, this is a, it's an interesting, uh, interesting and different sound from them, and I like it. It's uh, nice to hear a different sound from a band, to hear the different sides of them uh, like this. So I'm really liking this. And the love that you used to shine so bright was beautiful um it was kind of interesting to see pal take center stage like that and uh take the lead with the uh band um she usually sings harmony or kind of back up with while she's drumming it's interesting to see her on the piano like that she's got a beautiful voice they all do but um she's got some power behind her uh, vocals too um she's really passionate and uh really emotional with that so it seems like it's a very personal song to her um uh, just from the way she was singing that, how how much she was getting into it, but I'm glad I checked this out. Um, uh, so there are two songs that are grouped together that I'm going to be doing um, kind of out of order with this concert. Um, so I'm going to have one more song, and then I think it's uh, Our Mistakes and Wildfire are grouped together. I'm going to do them uh, kind of separate since they're together anyway. I think they're all in one video, but thank you so much for watching this video. I really appreciate it. Um, <clears throat> Uh, since you made it this far, just want to tell you about an amazing community called the Backwoods Posse, or BWP. Uh, it's more of a family, honestly. Uh, get music, movie, and TV show lovers. We also just hang out and talk and help each other out through live. Um, I'm going to leave a link in the description for the BWP Discord. Feel free to click on that uh, if you'd like to join the family. We'd love to have you. Um, I love and appreciate each and every one of you so much. And until the next video, peace. <laughs>